Alright, what's going on guys? It's AR Anime and today we're gonna be doing a different video today. Today we're gonna be doing a Shinobi Life 2 video, but instead of playing the game, we're gonna be um doing almost like a discussing video, like what I wanna see in the future updates and what they could have done to make this game better. I mean, I'm not gonna be bashing this game or whatever, but I'm gonna just be pointing out some minor things in my opinion that could have helped out the game and made it more f fun like it it would last longer for me at least and for other people but um yeah so i'll see you in the video but before we get into the video make sure you s like and subscribe um we're trying to hit 8k so everybody just go crazy bro everybody counts so um if you want to make my goal happen 8k then Go ahead and uh, like and subscribe. But um, yeah, we're gonna get into the video. Alright, so this video is pretty much gonna be um, one and two, okay? So I'm gonna explain what one is. One is gonna be like the minor things that they could have, I think they could have done to make the game better. So this is my personal opinion. Don't bash me for it. Don't like just hate me for this. But okay, so one of the minor things they could have done that just could have just made the game much better is um, not making it so like I'm not gonna say oh well, it is kind of paid to win to be honest like bro to get everything in the game all you do is just buy a private server and the server for hop for everything bro and you'll eventually get it so like if you have a private server you're straight you get anything that you want pretty much. Um, and I just find that like it makes it, it's it's just gonna make the game. I'm not saying that the game's gonna die out. I'm just saying that it's gonna make the game die out faster because like if you get things the harder like so Grand Piece for instance like it's really hard to get Devil Fruit. So a lot of I'm pretty sure a lot of people's gonna stay and play it a lot because they want a Devil Fruit or they want to try out new things that they haven't gotten. But like if you get it so fast and so easy then like there's literally no point so like with before they had private servers in the game i would see like one to two people that actually had a gen cloak which was really cool bro it, it wasn't like a rare i mean it wasn't like a common thing to see it was really rare and i like that about the game um now everything is just so like just like handouts bro like you get a private server you pay this amount of money you pay 700 robux oh you get everything in the game now it's kind of too late to implement well pretty much everything that i'm saying in this video is it's too late to implement into the game but i'm just giving out my reasons and reasonings to what they could have did to um just you know like i said like multiple times like just made the game better but um that's just what that's just one but um two um we got logs bro all right bro so i mean logs is not such a big deal but like real what i mean it it is kind of a big deal like people could just auto farm logs and get like it's so like everything is so easy like you don't really have to grind in this game like you don't have to really truly grind it, it, there's no like it's just nut bro it's just like so hand holding it's such a hand holding game i feel like if it wasn't such a hold hand holding game like they just like hold your hand throughout the whole gameplay of the like the whole experience then it would be so much better like logs all you got to do is get a auto clicker on your pc and just auto click the whole night or auto click for how long you really want to to be honest and you just get free levels Another thing is I feel like they should have implemented the tuning exams to rank up now Bro to get a high rank all you got like I said bro you auto click to level 1000 or you, you'll do a couple of quests then and there But most of the times people just auto click or whatever like that their gens or just levels in, in general and They'll just get those levels right They'll get to level 1000 and they just rank up it's an easy rank up I feel like this should implement more like PvP type base to rank up. You feel me? So like tuning exams and joining exams, they should have did that where you fight actual people 
to get your rank up so like it, just think about it like that would have been much cooler and i know it's a lot of people that don't like pvp or they're just not good at pvp but for the people that does like pvp this is like a p this is an rpg game like there should be more fighting in this game i feel like most people in the game they just go for stuff like this is really like a getting rare stuff oh i'm i'm cool because i have rare stuff in the game type game now like no one i really never see anybody fight anymore it's just like bro people if you go into a public you're just gonna see people auto clicking logs or just like doing their own thing or whatever like that most people are in private service um just trying to find op stuff um I'm, i guess you could find a lot of like um like if you want pvp there is arena x and uh arena x and uh arena but um I feel like for the RPG, they should implement more, and I feel like the RPG could just be a little bit better overall, but that's just my personal opinion. Um, if you have a different opinion on that, then um, just le just let me know in the comments, and we can just have like a friendly debate. Like, like I said, I'm not trying to bash them. I couldn't do any better than what they could do, for sure. Um, this is just some of the ideas I have towards the game and what they could have had done and to just make it better i've said that like so many times but i know a lot of people are just gonna just like just act stupid or say just just do it so i'm repeating myself a lot but um yeah so i mean that's pretty up much it for the minor stuff so like rank system auto clicking like how you level up is really boring um how you get stuff in the game is really boring is really paid to win um with the the spinning system I, honestly i can't really get on their case about that before i was but they're actually dropping a lot of codes like they've been dropping a, a shit ton of uh codes and you could pretty you could get a lot of good stuff i've seen a lot of i got a lot of friends that got in good stuff but before like I said, like when the game first came out, I literally bought like a thousand spins and got nothing. But they changed that, and I respect them for changing that, and that shows me that they really do care about their game. So that's a plus for the game. I'm not just gonna bash it. I'm gonna give out some good, valid points towards why the game is good too. I mean, I think this game is really decent. I don't think it's really a, like a like a good, good game, but it's really decent. It's a it's a playable game it's something that could, you know but um yeah so we're just it's gonna yeah we're gonna hop into um two so that's um the future updates what i want to see in the future updates so in the future updates um i would want to see just more like um i don't know like all right so now we're going to the uh, future updates so number two so future updates um what i want to see in the future for this game i want to see more like pvp based type um less like like just more skill like I, this game like it, it's just no like i'm sorry it's no skill to in this game like there's like no one that no one could eat bro no one could really truly say ease in this game and say oh i'm better i'm the better player because it really just depends on what what moves you have and what loadout you have a lot of attacks is um just just auto auto aim and stuff like that so there's not a lot of skill into this game it's not really skill based um a lot of people might say it is i personally don't think so um and i'm pretty sure it's like majority of people would agree with me because it's a lot of broken stuff in this game and it's a lot of stuff that's just not fair but um yeah so i mean th that's just the game of course there are going to be attacks that's better than a, a, um, another attack but overall like it's just so many skills and so much stuff that just doesn't require skill like there's like nothing in this game that i could think that just requires skill and i feel like having it where you actually have to aim or just do something would just be so much better now there are attacks where you have to aim i'm not sure i'm 
not sure what they are, but I know it is some attacks that you literally have to aim. But um, for like attacks like this, it's just auto aim. All that stuff is just auto aim. So um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Like I like what they're doing with the like uh, jutsus and stuff like that. I just don't like how you get them. Like I said, I don't like the how you server hop or it's at this time and you could just go in a private server and just go get it anytime you want to pretty much um because like i said you'll eventually get it sooner or later um but um yeah that's really all i could think of um that would those three things that i mentioned would just fix the game in so many ways bro it would make this game so much better to me a lot of people still like that. Like, like I said, I mean, they don't really have to do this because they have 128,000 people playing it, and they're going to be successful no matter what. And I understand that, but I mean, just I just want them to think about their game, which they have been doing. I just want them to think more about the game and make it more uh, skill based, other than like just whoever has the better move. Whoever buys private servers to get all of this, the goodies and stuff like that. Um, it really just made the game born to me way faster because, like, when I got a private server, I was just getting everything. I was like, bruh, like, I almost got, like, everything, bro. Like, what's the point of the game now? Like, I have everything. What, what do I do? PvP? Now, since I have, like, everything, I have all this broken stuff, like, it's just gonna start getting boring now so like what is what else is it to do now it's also like other game modes in the game which might be fun and stuff like that that I haven't checked out like story mode I heard that was really really fun and it had a lot of stuff in it in that mode that was just amazing I heard that was like the best part of Shinobi Life 2 but it's I think I'm, I believe it's closed community and um, you gotta do something to get into it, I'm not sure. But, um, yeah, I feel like they shouldn't, I mean, if they're focused of, like, I feel like RPG, since it's to the public, that should be the best game mode there is, bro. Because, I mean, think about it, it's just the RPG mode, bro. Like, why would the story be better than the, the stuff that's to the public, like, that's everyone's that's gonna have access to? Why would they make the the close community part which few people could access? I'm not gonna say few, but some people could access um, better than the RPG. But um, yeah, that's just my input on it, and that's what I think about it. Um, like I said, this is a really decent game. I feel like what can make this game way better is if they implement those things that I talked about in this video. But, um, yeah, I don't want this video to be too long, which it probably is, but, um, yeah, this is gonna be, like, I'm not gonna really edit anything out, I'm gonna just keep it raw, and, yeah, so, yeah, that's how I feel about Shinobi Life 2. Overall, it's, it's an okay game to me. Like I said, it really just got born and just, it, it just, that's why you haven't really seen me doing the live streams in two weeks, or the Shinobi Life videos in two weeks. I just posted one like yesterday, a Shinobi Life video yesterday, but before that I haven't posted a Shinobi Life 2 video in two weeks, and I used to always post Shinobi Life content on my channel. Matter of fact, like that's like mostly what my success came from on this channel of Shinobi Life, so I appreciate that for all that, but um, yeah, like I, the game just got really, really boring, and it amazed me that they still keep 128,000 players. I don't see how people haven't got bored yet, but like I said, that's just me, man. Other people are different, and I respect people's opinion on things, and if they wanna play it, hey, I'm not gonna bash them for playing the game. But like, personally, if like they don't, I mean, well, they it's kinda too late to come, it's kinda too late to implement the things that I said, so like, Overall, it's probably I'm not gonna consider this a good game ever because unless they implement, I, I doubt that they're gonna do that. But um, yeah, it's an okay game, bro. It, it was it was really fun. Like when it first came out, bro. Like I said, when the private server wasn't out and everybody didn't just have literally everything, bro. And 
and public servers where people have to fight for like the whole public server had to fight for to get something rare like that was so cool bro it was like bro like not everybody could get this bro not everybody has this so like when you see this when you encounter somebody with it bro you could be like wow bro you could look he flex on them bro if you encounter like a, a gin cloak or a um, lightning cloak or whatever like that it was like that bro but now bro like jeez man and then you got exploiters bro like they need to work harder on their anti-cheat also i feel like i don't like i said i haven't played this game and i like i literally didn't touch this game in two weeks so some of this stuff it might be in the game i'm not sure but like before i played it again like before i played it well i really haven't like just sat down and played this game like bro i haven't sat down and played this game at like ever to be honest but um actually i have but in the beginning but yeah i don't know man but yeah that's it for this video i'm making this video way too long um this video is not really to get a lot of views i know it's probably not gonna get a lot of views or whatever but i'm just making it just to make it and um yeah this is ar anime if you agree with me just say that you agree with me if you don't don't like don't just go crazy on that dislike button bro i mean you can if you want to because that still helps out but like like just consider my opinion bro to like just come on man like everybody has an opinion but um yeah do whatever dislike like i don't really care but um yeah that's my opinion on shinobi life 2 uh i'm talking too much this is air anime peace out